first the top stories. Times of Manipur celebrates first Foundation Day with fanfare. National Cleanliness Day observed to mark 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi. Really say no to plastic, yes to sustainable development health. Good evening and welcome to Times of Manipur. This is Suraj Kongban Taban giving you the news, now the news in detail. Manipur's first ever private satellite news channel, Tom TV celebrated its first anniversary today. A tree plantation program was held at Pisun Chinga Hills, Imphal, which was followed by a blood donation camp at Jawaharlal Nehru Institute of Medical Sciences, Jenims Param Path, Imphal, to mark the occasion. Altogether, 15 employees of Tom TV donated blood at the camp. Editor of Tom TV, Jit Nungomba, program head Bobby Wahingbam, creative head Lawrence Takhelambam, executive editor Damendra Wangkemcha, host of Tom TV actress Jolly Irungbam also took part in the tree plantation program and blood donation camp. Social activist Manoranjan also attended the tree plantation program. Around 1,000 saplings of various kinds were planted. Later, a grand feast was held at LZ Rose Garden, Urembam Imphal, as part of the celebration. <laughs> Time so many put Tom TV. Say him on Pung Park Pass, the Ida Hoy, Harauti Amba, Miami Sebato, the Bats him on Pung Park Basida Hoy, Levacu and Labour. Of climate change labour, where there is change labour, you can go to Can Banga no Pandam Dak Hoy would have it from Sipan to seven. Sing the Uyan Tetra, Ligita Wooding, a city, Pura, a quay economic canoe driver, Belenci uniform with Raba, agriculture, the Suyam, now what you think of a pire, a do what had a thing manjida with a Sanga Lagadis Hoy and a Hanagi. ไทยนี่ไปพวกนอร์มัลโดอะมอหานาละกันเนี่ยนะไอ้อาสาตอกไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้
CLP leader O. Ibobi further stated that Gandhi defeated the British by means of non-violence. He added that we must not forget that it is our duty to follow the footsteps of Mahatma Gandhi who did not see differences in caste or creed and who made immense contribution in India's freedom the struggle. Congress ki ideology principle maduda koi manada ba koi khuda makshi manana ba violence to ga nampu to ga gun point da sason to bisi di id id machine lasting hoi gani hai bisi thaje de aduna koi congress karmi pona makna aina apil tawjaning badi koi khuda mak na hona na wasak pag loina na bapu ji na pamjaram ba Congress ki ideology principle do koi kai dinu chalan ba bapu ji na pamjaram ba do koi thabak oi no thok na ba khona ra patata ngasi gi observation asi gi wahan thok lai gani hai ba i wa phong khachi thamjal ga sai sum te hanje the function was also attended by mpcc workers frontal organizations sales dccs bccs mpcc chief gai khangam stated that gandhi was a leader who firmly believed in non violence on his 150th birth anniversary we must all have the feeling of brotherhood and embrace non violence he added he also said that we must not forget that truth always trumps <laughs> ฉันก็ไม่ได้ไปเอาเสียสิ่งที่ตั้งตัวอาชุ่มมาไม่ได้ Shanti Lambida Satuna Koi Aroiba Jahita Pavana Shanti Hada Shola Gamalikita Later, the participants took out a rally from the Congress Bhavan and culminated at MG Avenue. CLP leader O. Ibobi and MPCC President Gai Khangam also took part in the rally. Celebrating 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi, a mass awareness campaign on the ban of single-use plastic was held today at Ghari Youth Club Airport Road, Imphal, under Swachita Seva. The theme of the rally was Say No to Plastic, Yes to Sustainable Development. More than 200 students from different schools in Ghari area and the local residents took part in the mass awareness campaign organized by National Highway and Infrastructure Development Corporation Limited, NHIDCL. A cleanliness program was also held. Speaking on the sideline of the event, Director of NHIDCL, ANF Headquarters, Satya Brata Sahu said that NHIDCL organized the awareness campaign on the ban of single-use plastic in its different branch offices across the country by engaging the local bodies and all the stakeholders. He also said that school children are being engaged in this campaign to motivate and make them aware of the effects of plastic. He said that the public has a great role in putting an end to the use of single-use plastic which is hazardous to public health. Through public awareness campaigns, motivating the school children, the local Panchayati Raj institution members, urban local bodies, and all the stakeholders, the public representatives, we should join hand and fulfill the dreams of our Honorable Prime Minister, who has appealed to all to ban this plastic, which is having serious health hazards. You know, the effect of uh, plastic is very bad for the health of uh, human being. So we have to do that. So I am very happy in Manipur, yesterday also I visited Thowal and today in Mani Imphal uh, city itself, people are very keen to join this movement. I wish all success to the people of Manipur. As part of the cleanliness drive in connection with uh, uh, Gandhi Jayanti, National uh, Highway Infrastructure Development Committee and HIDCL, along with the local students and the people in the locality here at Gari are cleaning, uh, taking out the cleanliness drive. They are picking up the waste materials which are thrown on the roadside of the highway. But the question is, if such activities continue to be taken up every day, then one can see the beautiful city uh, that 
keeps the cleanliness and maintain the road in a very proper and in a very systematic way. With camera person Sarachandra, Blessing Gang Mai for Tom TV News, Gari. Education Minister T.H. Radheshyam stated that even though the infrastructure of a school is weak, development of the particular school can be brought if there is good relation between the teachers and the students. Speaking at a press conference at the conference hall of Directorate of Education as Minister Radheshyam further stated that teachers must build a good relation between the students to enable them taking part in competition in the field of development. The minister said that essay, debate and other competitions will be held at various schools from September 26 to October 25th to commemorate the birth anniversary of Lamyan by Hizam Irawad and Mahatma Gandhi. He added that their ideologies must be followed by today's generation. He asserted that it is a matter of pride that Manipur got 88.2% 80 after evaluating the indicator by the Niti Ayok, which was divided into three categories. He urged the support of the masses in marching towards the development pace. <laughs> Double we hella pire masi pire kosi harat padegi. Adu impact na koi classroom kya sara kani laboratory kya sara kani computer adet learning ya koi taro kini smart classroom ya taro kani adu na matam kare chanda ni thuna mukti khudak to ubadi adu to uva phangwe. In connection with the 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi, Education Minister Radhe Shyam today paid an inspection visit to several schools in the state and interacted with students. Talking in this regard, Minister Radeshyam underlined on the need of youngsters follow the principles and ideologies of Gandhi. He also maintained that guardians, teachers and parents play a pivotal role in guiding the youth to the right path. Gandhi is the most important part of the country. In the past, the most important part of the country is the principal of the country. The most important part of the country is the most important part in Imphal West Commando cleaned the road streets from Ragailong Gate to Minuthong in Imphal City to mark Gandhi Jayanti today. Meanwhile, celebrating Gandhi Jayanti, the Imphal East District Police also cleaned Porampa DC Road and also the complex of the District Superintendent of Police this morning. District Administration Imphal East organized a district level cleanliness program commemorating 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi today. The program was also attended by Deputy Commissioner of Imphal East, Rangita Balivaikom, Subdivisional Officers, Superintendent of Police, Imphal East, Jogesh Chandra Haubizam, Additional Superintendent of Police Operations, T.H. Krishna Tombi, Adakshyas, Jila Parishads and Prathan. President of Jalangrong Human Rights Protection for Manipur, Robert Gonmay, accused Biran government of disobeying order of High Court of Manipur. Speaking at a press meet at Chingmai Rong today, Robert further said it is unfortunate that the government is reappointing G. Robindro, a retired chief engineer, as OSD. Robert appealed to the government to remove G. Robindro from his post or they will take up democratic agitations. The press meet was also attended by member of Laumi Loop Imphal East. H. Jadumani and members of the forum. Mahakna Sahagali, but Mahakna Sahi, 40 years, Sahi Nipu Pubam Tamda, Mahaki Dam, Aduga Project Miam failed to give the Una Una Amuka, re engaged to gay Han, OSD Amukwege Han, Cabinet, Cabinet de Shalo Cray Han, Loto City, Equity, Asigumba, Tawong, Asi, Gormin, Yam, Nakan, Yaning, Bapundoi, other Asi. Democratic form of education is the human rights uh, uh, protection forum. So, uh, democratic form of education is Taking part in the press meet, member of Lomi Loop Imphal is H. Jadumani said that reappointing a retired chief engineer as OSD is just like selling an expired medicine with a new seal. He expressed shock over having two chief engineers at the small department. 
He added that the government is disobeying the order to cancel the appointment. ปราชาสิงห์กีไอ้คุยกีไฮตาเรดีเวลอปเมนต์วอร์คสิดาก็มาซังทุกปะทบอัมตะตอรอมดรบะมะตุงสิดาเพนซินซัลอบะมะตุ
The operation was carried out under the supervision of additional superintendent of police operations, T.H. Krishna Tombi. Around 80 people were verified during the operation, but no one was picked up, as sources said. A combined team of Imphalis Commando and 26 Assam Rifles apprehended an active member of Kanglai Yawal Kanalup KYKL from Thambalnu Market, Angatha area. The arrested has been identified as self-styled Lieutenant R.K. Premjit Singh, also known as Chinglen and Tomba, from Bisnupur Ward No. 9, currently residing at Umathil Makhalikai, Waikong. He was handed over to Andhra Police Station for further verification. Meanwhile, a combined team of Imphalis Commando and 5th Jammu and Kashmir Rifles also apprehended an active member of Kanglepa Communist Party Noyon Group near Kongpal Khaidem Kaipung. The arrested has been identified as self-styled Private Wang Kim Rakesh Singh, also known as Lam Yanba, age 32, son of W. Tom Chow Singh from Wang Khai Koizam Lekai. On investigation, it was revealed that he had been working under self-styled Second Lieutenant Devin of the outfit. Rakesh was handed over to Porompat Police Station for further investigation. Let's now have the sports news. In sports news today, the annual sports meet of Dr. Colvin Academy More has begun today. The sports meet, which is held on the theme Play with Christ, was inaugurated by President of More Consumer Club, Seiboy Hockey. The sports meet kicked off after a social service was held as part of the National Cleanliness Day. Social workers Thangkolun Hockey and Hachin Hockey attended the program as men guests. Several students, parents, and teachers also attended the event. Let's take another short commercial break. Do stay tuned for more updates. Pabiyu, Nainabiyu, Tanabiyu, Lumsing the Times. Makal Mathil Ki Kudol, Maru Oiba Pau, Local, National, International, Sanabung Ki Pau Gdam. Mahiroi Singh Ki Namag, Maitai Mayekta Akhanana, Mapung Faraba Pau Ngo Singh Ba, Lumsing the Times, Lumsing the Times. Isa Isa Ki Pau Se Thadari Ba Hokar Singh Da Hai Biraga, Lobi Ba Yaragani. Welcome back. Organizing Committee International Day of Nonviolence, Manipur observed the 13th International Day of Nonviolence and 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi today at the Manipur Hindi Parishad in All Assembly Road, Imphal. The observance was attended by Acting Chairperson of Manipur Human Rights Commission, Khaide Mani, Vice President of Senior Citizens of Manipur for Society, and Bihari Maite, President of Mahila Kalyan Samiti, A.B. Mola Devi, and others. In this regard, Khaide Mani urged the general public to give up violence and approach the human, Manipur Human Rights Commission for any issue. Kendriya Bidyalaya No. 1 Lamfeld part of Imphal West also celebrated 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi today. The students of the school staged a rally around Lamfel Sanaketel carrying a message of cleanliness during which they cleaned the roadsides. Principal of KV Lamfeld part M. Paswan said that the future generations should be made aware of importance of a clean society. इस कार्यक्रम से निश्चित रूप से जो है हम जो पांच किलोमीटर दो किलोमीटर तीन किलोमीटर वॉकिंग कर रहे हैं इससे निश्चित ही हमारी सेहत जो है हमारे बच्चों की सेहत जो है स्वस्थ होंगे और जब बच्चों की सेहत स्वस्थ होगा तो हमारे देश भी स्वस्थ हो जाएंगे धन्यवाद Celebrating the 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi today, a tree plantation program was conducted at the Bee Park located at Sanjabung Kangmong. Speaking at the program, Chairman of Kunai Scientific Beekeepers and Producers Corporation Limited, Dr. S. Mangi, informed that the objective of the event was to embrace the ideology of Mahatma Gandhi on preserving the environment and also to turn the Bee Park into an ecological park. Today's occasion was attended by several members of KBKPCSL. More than 300 medicinal plants, including 150 banana trees, were planted at the program. Kunai scientific beekeepers and the producers company na ma Gandhi ki mapung numit ma ki samya kai shubha mapung numit sikha loyena na koi na ma ondaju koi na tribute homage piva loyena na koi na ma na pamzer ba environment kanbada ay koi company ju. Madugi Chao, Togdangam, Logjabulunana, Koi Mapamzeleva, Koi B Foxy, Mr. Queen Uzar, Tabuki, Tabuki, Pangu Chavani. 
Moray Police today conducted a clean release program at Moray Town as part of Swachatahi Seva, Indo Myanmar Friendship Gate, Moray Market, and other locations were cleaned during the program. Part of Imphal Moray Highway was also repaired by using JCB. The event was attended by additional superintendent of police KS Robinson and additional superintendent of police commando operations Amit and other police officials. As part of Swachata Hiseva, the uh, Okodom in association with Watam and MCM also conducted a cleanliness program in the surrounding area of Mori Market today. Under the Swachatahi Seva and commemorating the 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi, the Bisnupur District Water and Sanitation Committee today organized a cleanliness drive covering Bisnupur Police Station and Mini Secretariat. The drive was attended by Kumbi MLAS Bira, Deputy Commissioner of Bisnupur Nita Arambam, Retired Executive Engineer El Gokul Chandra and other district level officers. Talking to media, MLA Bira lauded Prime Minister Narendra Modi for realizing the Gandhi's dream of maintaining cleanliness in the nation. On the other hand, Deputy Commissioner Bisnupur Nita Rambam appealed the masses to stop using single-use plastic in order to keep the environment clean. A public rally was took out alongside an awareness program on cleanliness was held at the Panchayat Resource Centre, Bisnupur. Prime Minister Narendra Modi today led the nation in paying respect to Mahatma Gandhi on his 150th birth anniversary by paying tribute to the father of the nation at the Rajghat this morning. He stayed for some time at the Rajghat where an all fair prayer meeting was being held. Former Prime Minister Manmohan Singh and senior BJP leader LK Advani also arrived at Rajghat to pay tribute to the Mahatma Gandhi. A large number of events are lined up across the nation as the country observes the 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi today. Meanwhile, Congress President Sonia Gandhi today said those who consider themselves supreme and indulge in the politics of falsehood will not understand Mahatma Gandhi's sacrifices and ideals. In what appeared to be a swipe at the present BJP leadership, Sonia Gandhi told party workers and leaders at Rajghat that the Mahatma Gandhi's soul would be pained by what has happening in India in the last few years. Sonia Gandhi also administered an oath on Gandhi's ideals to party workers on the 150th anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi. Let's now have the top stories of today's newspaper headlines. Disangai Express, political parties endorse public resolution on integrity. Nipko Nimpal revisit merger agreement. RI for convict under POXO Act. Ibobi rules out more defections. The People's Chronicle, Manpack lines up anti cap protests starting October 3. High time for political parties to unite on FA, UCM. Photo contest winners, elderly citizens honored. The Morning Bell, Chief Minister Advocates join effort to deal with drug menace. 4,897 acres of poppy cultivation destroyed. Over 800 cases of opium products seized since 2017, Chief Minister. Court sentences sexual assault convict to five years is RI in nine different cases. Governor, MP, CM, Ministers greet on Gandhi Zanti. Minister Lekpao inaugurates Health Center in Yangoland, Chandel. Imphal free phrase, all parties reaffirm safeguarding state territory integrity. Minister seeks public support in banning single-use plastics. Manipur Mail, Chief Minister Viran appeals for united effort to fight drug menace. Gai Khangam, 
কংগ্রেস এম এল এস ইউনাইটেড Before we wind up, let's have a quick look at the top stories once again. Times of Manipur celebrates first foundation day with fanfare. National Cleanliness Day observed to mark 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi. And really say no to plastic, yes to sustainable development health. Well, that's all for now. Keep watching Times of Manipur.